Customs Service and CS Bashir ad Dinias now disclosed the seizure of illicit goods, military camouflage, including tramadol and other illicit drugs worth 31.2 billion naira by the Area 2 command of the service uh, on a port in River State. The Comptroller General disclosed these at the on sea port of River State while uh, displaying the seized illegally smoked goods, uh, smuggled goods in uh, 12 40 feet containers. He said the seizures were made in strict compliance with the customs laws, particularly concerning concealment, forced declaration, and importation of pre bitted items. Adeni, who expressed delight that trade facilitation was getting traction in honor, said the repeated incidents of smuggling of illicit goods through the port was of grave concern to the nation's security. The seizures on display include one, a 40 footer container of 4,800 pairs of military stroke paramilitary camouflage, rain boots, and 67,320 pairs of various rubber footwear with a total duty paid value, 943 million and 40,000 Naira. Two, there are three 40 footer containers which contains 562,600 bottles of 100 milligram cough syrup with codeine and 3,150 pieces of chili cutters with a DPV, that's total paid value of 4 billion 716 million 573,846 naira. All these interventions have a duty paid value of a staggering 31 billion 200 million 688,142 naira. He also urged uh, the public to contribute their quota to security through information sharing. It is therefore a matter of regret that criminal elements in the international supply chain are currently exploiting our pro-trade stand to commit atrocities that border on national security. Effective immediately, we will be implementing emergency protocols at on airport. For the next three months, we will be conducting very thorough examinations on all sus suspicious containers even if the owners do not come forward for examination, we will open these containers to verify their contents. This will be a temporary but necessary measure to clean up the port and restore its integrity. We will need your help in providing credible intelligence regarding those that are behind these nefarious acts and their intentions, their agents, their cohorts, their collaborators, those who collect these items for them, those who market them in our markets, and of course, those who are responsible for their distribution and uh, they allowed it to enter illegal hands. The Comptroller General, however, assured the business community and that leaders made importance and readiness to ensure a safe and secure environment for genuine business activities to thrive. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.